I decided to start this series of videos where I point out a single moment or an entire scene on which I think an actor absolutely excels, be it in a film or television show. I think actors can make or break a good script sometimes, and I'm a sucker for a good performance. Because I teach acting and work with actors professionally, I tend to notice subtleties that can sometimes go unnoticed, and my goal is to point these out and try and dissect the performance so people can start appreciating and understanding even more why a performance is good. For no particular reason, other than that I saw this scene a few days ago, I decided to kickstart this series with the actress Eden Scher, mostly known for her work in the ABC family sitcom The Middle. She portrays Sue Heck, the middle child in the Heck family, characterized by her unending hope in life, an unbeatable spirit, always finding ways to see things from a positive point of view, even when it seems impossible to do so. Even though I think The Middle is an average show when it comes to its writing and general direction, I still watch it with pleasure, and the main reason for that is Eden Share's work. Her Sue Heck is in my opinion the heart and soul of the show, and it's definitely what keeps me going back to it. It's not that the remaining cast doesn't bring anything, they do, and a lot, but Eden's work just sparkles with finesse that can sometimes go easily unnoticed and taken for granted. I think it's safe to say that like so many other examples in television history, Eden Scher made her character much larger and successful than it was probably foreseeable by the show's creators and writers, at least in my opinion. So to cut to the chase I decided to pinpoint a single scene from the middle, on which I think Eden Scher shines as an actress. I love to see drama in a comedy, I absolutely love it. This show does it sometimes, but they always seem to chicken out and take a step back before it gets too serious. But that's a whole different issue for another time. To give you some context, this scene is at the end of the second episode called The Loneliest Locker from the sixth season on which the main storyline focuses on Sue Heck deciding which college she wants to go to when she graduates and also a play she's performing at school. Faced with such high hopes on her future, Mike and Frankie, Sue's parents, are unable to disappoint her by telling her the truth that they probably cannot afford to pay for college. So they decide to get extra jobs and try to raise money. The majority of the episode focuses on this, and especially on Frankie that is working very hard from home providing customer service for a local airline. The episode climaxes with Sue's play being awful and inherently funny, of course, and with Frankie having to miss her daughter's play because of the second job. The scene in question is when Sue gets back home and confronts her mother about missing her play and how she's missing out on her senior year in high school and so on. Of course, poor Sue Heck is unaware of the sacrifice in motion by her parents, and her mother in particular, to get her to college. To highlight is the way Eden Scher handles the moment Frankie blows up on Sue and tells her the truth about the lack of money. Sue's subtle shift from anger to guilt and compassion is masterfully done by Eden Scher and is not within the reach of many actors. The way you kind of feel Sue is lying with a smile because she has to. The disappointment sinking in like a giant bulldozer dragging her to the bottom of the ocean. You sink right along with her. Why did you even take this job anyway? You're already so busy. Well, it's not like I oh, wanted... You're missing my whole senior year. You're just missing everything. You want to know why, Sue? Do you want to know why? Because I don't know how we're going to pay for your college, all right? I mean, I am trying really hard here to embrace the possible, but you know what? It's just getting harder and harder because you want to go to all these great and awesome places and we want to send you there. But to tell you the truth, I just don't know how it's going to happen. I just don't know at all. I wanted to tell you Chili's. <sighs> Look, I know. I know we can't afford any of those schools. I was just talking and dreaming and stuff for fun. But I would never want to do anything that would make you guys have to work harder. You guys work so hard already. But I love you. And honestly, 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 please don't kill yourself for me. Whatever happens, I am going to be fine. This is a tremendous performance in an otherwise typical television show. This type of scene is extremely demanding to work as effectively as it does here. I've seen it done well and I've seen it done perfectly and Eden Share does it perfectly. It's so hard to make these emotional transitions effectively without it being too sudden or overacted and she makes it seem effortless. It's the kind of work that is impossible to go unnoticed in my eyes and it's one of the many examples that make the middle above average from time to time. 
Patricia Heaton, who plays Frankie, is also extremely effective and certainly enhances Eden's work. It's a great scene with two great performances in it. I honestly think Eden Cher has a great career ahead of her and I hope to see her in bigger and more challenging roles in the future. There's one more thing. The most important element. <laughs> now I'm soothed.